Hey, it's Mel from Kentucky Anna's Morning Show on 97.5 WAMZ, and I've just come across something that's made me so happy. I can't tell you how I found it, but I kind of found it, and I have to share it with you. Are you ready? In case you can't tell, this is my beloved co-host, Chris Randolph, in the 80s! It's so fabulous! And yes, it took me about 30 seconds to realize it was him. And so I'm going to take this around the building, uh, the entire building here, and see other people's reaction to young Chris Randolph. Okay, so I'm here with Bill Gentry, who is the Grand Poobah. I think that's your official title, right? The Grand Poobah of Clear Channel. And I want to show you this photograph, and I just want your initial reaction, okay? Are you ready? Oh, God. <laughs> You hired him! Is that Randolph or Rick Dees? <laughs> <laughs> I think that says it all. Rick Dees. And we're with one of my favorite people, Cindy Sullivan. I've known her for years, worked together for years. We, we laugh a lot together, but I have a feeling this might be a different sort of laughter. I'm going to show you a photo. I just want your natural reaction, okay? Okay. Here Easy. we go. Oh my gosh! How cute is he? I gotta tell you, you're the first person to use the word cute. Well, you know what? <laughs> Nobody could get that little 80s goof like that. It isn't a good goof. Are those highlights? Have you words? seen the beer commercial where the guy comes in, like his hair is like, and then, and then he switches it? <laughs> this is what it's reminding this is the me before. of. This is the before. Uh, or the after. Or the after. <laughs> I like it. So basically. He doesn't clean up so well now. I, I, I was trying to find a polite way to say it. <laughs> that was it. What she said. And of course to WAMC listeners, everybody knows our friend LG Dupree. Absolutely. How are you, LG? Wonderful. Well, I got I'm a little phone. nervous, but I'm... I know. It, it, it's, it sounds scary, but trust me, you're going to love this. I'm oh going to gosh. show you the photo of someone that works in this building, mm -hmm. and I just want your honest first reaction, okay? <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's not even funny. Okay, can you even tell who it is? Because some people haven't been able to tell. Well, I, I thought it was Kevin Bacon. <laughs> And, but He's I'm, kind of bacon-ish, isn't he? Yeah, but I see the big forehead, and I know that's Randolph's <laughs> fat head. Uh, he didn't. It quite... is a little disproportionate if you wow. think torso to head. What happened to the guy? <laughs> Did he go touring through a nuclear power plant or something? I mean, <laughs> radio happened. Wow. Oh, well, radio and, and and good wine. That's it. Age of one of my favorite people, Tony Vanetti. Hello, everybody. Okay, now we've been showing this photo to several. Okay. Members of the staff. And I All right. I've finally been waiting for this for a long time. <laughs> That's not that Go with the not video. Not that oh, video. Bummer. Something totally different. It was like your first initial reaction to this photo. <laughs> <laughs> oh. First of all, oh. you can even tell who it is because some yeah, people haven't been able it's to. It's your partner. Yeah. Oh my God. It's Randolph. That's awful. <laughs> He hates your guts for showing that. That's because he doesn't. I think know. he. I like him fatter. <laughs> I think I do. I think he's better looking fatter than thin. What about the hair? I think you should put that on the website. <laughs> Randolph, fatter or thinner? Wh who's more attractive? I think with less hair and fatter, he's better looking. See? So this is my buddy Charlie Steele. Yeah, we've worked together longer than either of us would probably want to admit to. And we've been asking other people in the building their reaction, their first initial reaction to a photo. Okay, are you okay. ready for this? Okay. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> is that Rick's, what, what soap opera was he on? <laughs> Okay. What year of uh, General Hospital? <laughs> <laughs> okay, first of all, Rick Springfield. I get no. that popped in. Wishes he looked as that good hair, as Chris Randolph. You know. Obviously, is it the hair? Is it the tie? It's is the it the smile. manly physique? It's the, it's the smile. Is it's that it? whole, you know, I could have been on a soap opera, or I could have been back in your grocery <laughs> smile. <laughs> like hey. I gotta tell you, you, you seem a little turned on. Maybe just a little bit. I got a little man crush. A little, 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 little man crush on that person, Mr. Randolph. And, and so, how would you uh, consider, like, the difference between this and the Randolph we know today? Uh, the head seems to have grown. <laughs> <laughs> Along with kind of yeah. the rest of them. It, it's weird because even here, you'll notice there's a discrepancy in torso to head. Yeah. And it's like now, the head still... But the hair kind of balanced it out. Exactly. It kind of elongated his head. And as we, opposed to now. And we've been debating. <laughs> highlights? Are those highlights? Did he get highlights? This one needs no introduction. The great Terry Miners. Now, Bill, Terry, we're going around and we're asking everybody in the building uh, their reaction. First, if they can even recognize who it is in this photo. Okay. And if so, you know, what's your first reaction is when you see this? 
Oh! <laughs> it looks like the guy that was on American Idol with Ryan Seacrest Don't at the beginning. Ryan Don't go in. <laughs> <laughs> so far, oh. we've had uh, Duran Duran. We've had Rick Dees. Oh, Rick Dees. There's um, a little bit of love in Jack that, Jack Wagner. So apparently there's some soap opera theme, which wow. I'm not quite sure about. Christopher <laughs> Randolph, let me tell you something, buddy. That was a lot of cheeseburgers ago. <laughs> <laughs> but look at it. Highlights, man. Are those not highlights? Oh, those are exactly what that is. He looks like he dipped his head in Crisco right before they <laughs> shot that photo right there. Looks very good. I didn't realize that Kmart sold all of those accessories, but clearly. They get the little clip on time that's and everything. Nice. That fool, man. Looks like he's just leaving detention at St. X High School right there. <laughs> very nice. Uh, how do you sit next to that boy every day? Well, luckily, I don't get this version because this would have been a little creepy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dunkelman, bring out the next country star. Here's a man that needs no introduction, but I'll do it anyway. The one and only Coyote. Of course, Thank we all you. know and love. Now, I have a photo of yeah. a member of your staff. Okay. okay. And I want to see if A, you can identify it, okay. and B, your, what your reaction is to this. Holy moly! <laughs> Good God almighty! <laughs> How many decades ago was that made? I think it was the early to mid 80s. That's 1880s. his story. The 1880s? <laughs> this picture was made when the Dead Sea was only slightly <laughs> sick. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> so I would like to put in a request for a more masculine co host. <laughs> Can we do that? Because this is not working for me. <laughs> this ain't working for none of us. <laughs> Goodbye, ratings! <laughs> Goodbye, audience! <laughs> So long, Randolph. Been nice working with you. Adios. Yeah. And, and don't let the door hit you in the beep when you leave. <laughs>